further inland. Flooding is also a threat with this storm. And street flooding and flooded out cars are the big concern. KPRC2's Brittany Jeffers live from the Barker Reservoir, Reservoir in West Houston with the latest for us on this. Brittany, good morning. Good morning to you, and I do want you to take a look at Barker Reservoir behind me. We heard from Jeff Lidner tweeting out, he's from Harris County Flood Control District, that this reservoir, as well as Attic's Reservoir right now, are empty and that they are at maximum storage capability. So, as you can see, things are quiet out here right now, not any rain in the area, but of course, officials are keeping an eye on conditions. Now, we do want you to take a look at some video. This is from some light rain around the area this morning. Harris County Flood Control District is a warning about the possible of heavy rain and flooding in the coming days, especially in areas closer to the coast. Meteorologist Jeff Lindner says that the ground is currently dry, which might help soak up some of the initial rains, but that could change as the ground gets more saturated. It's just too soon to say if any creek or bayou would have issues because it just it, it's, a, it's still uncertain where exactly that heaviest rain uh, is going to fall. Now, also happening this morning, Houston Mayor Sylvester Turner says that the city will activate its Office of Emergency Management Operations. Now, Fort Bend County also preparing for the possibility of five to eight inches of rain. We are expected to hear from the Fort Bend County judge later this morning around nine o'clock on preparations in the area. Coming up in the next half hour, we're going to hear from the director of their emergency management operations uh, as far as what preparations are looking like. Reporting live, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC. Two news. All right, Brittany, thank you.